the Monetary Authority has received over 950 fraud-related complaints in the first nine months of the year, almost double last year's total. The city's de facto central bank urged people to stay vigilant, especially when they receive a link on social messaging platforms. The Monetary Authority said fraud-related cases have been increasing. The city's de facto central bank received 954 complaints between January and September, far exceeding last year's total of 555. Around 70 percent of the complaints involved credit card transactions. The authority's deputy chief executive Arthur Yoon said most fraudsters would send text messages to their targets and claim that their reward scheme points are about to expire. They would encourage victims to redeem their gifts by clicking on fraudulent links. But recently, the scammers have changed tactics. At least in the past month or so, we are beginning to receive complaints in relation to those WhatsApp messages. Um, people hacking someone's phone and then sending out messages on those instant messaging platforms pretending to be friends. Um, but because it came from a, a friend's sort of WhatsApp, so on the face of it, it looks like legitimate. Um, but then it would sometimes normally provide a link for you to, um, to, to, to press the link and then um, it will lead you to a payment arrangements and transfer money out of your account to the fraudsters. The Monetary Authority earlier said it is working to set up an alert system for suspicious transactions conducted on the Faster Payment System, or FPS. The system is expected to come into operation in two months.